When we were young in this place, the falconeers were messengers and guardians. Oh. They carried memories and spirits to the beyond. Now those origins are lost, and their lives and memories are lost to battle. But you can learn from them, their memories soaring through the clouds above the seas. Let us find out what stories remain in these splintered fragments the currents have brought us. We must find the fragmented story currents. Imperial Peak is the Imperial Seat, the highest attainable seat in the Empire. Towering over Imperial Harbor and the Ursi, its inhabitants are blinded to the plight of those below. Only those who serve the Empress ever perch on its balconies or set foot on its marble floors. Let's do this. You are Templar. Welcome, everyone. The Falconeer. Choose now what stories and memories await oh. you. What can be gleaned from these lives? Hood man. Part man, part hood. Ensign fell. I don't think we get a choice. Oh, we can be a lady. We can be a lady. Hard to tell, though. It's so tiny and pixelated. Also, I've seen gameplay. I'm not sure it makes that much of a difference. But, well, I mean, I like the hood. I As like the son the... of a lesser noble, being accepted for training by the warbird forces of the Imperium is a great honor. Oh. A chance for your house to rise in standing. Your aptitude with the bird in combat is clear, and you are a rising star. However, tragedy strikes and your family loses its ships and holdings to no. the Freebooter Rebellion. With Damn your commission as an officer lost, your only route forward is as an Imperial privateer. You fight the Imperium's enemies as an independent asset. You are a privateer. Oh. Ascend now, Falconeer. I will. Attention applicants! Your Empress needs you. With these incidents east of Dunkel and the Freebooter threat, we have fallen on desperate times. If successful, you'll be part of a new garrison at the Imperial Peak. Many of you will fail these tests. Only the very best can serve at this post. Today we start with simple performance assessments for each of you. The Empress has an appointment at her Thunderstrike flagship at the exact time. So no wandering off or deviating from the flight plan. There will be repercussions if you do. Good luck. Righteous. Morning, oh, Greenhorn. Let's see you fly that warbird. Start off with a slow dive. Chop chop. Diving accelerates your bird and generates energy for special maneuvers. Good. Your bird is energized for dashes and rolls. Show me a strong dash. Now let me see some evasive rolling. You can do this by dashing while turning. Rolling. You have good control of your warbird. Now let's see how observant you are. Imperial Harbor is just south of the Imperial Peak. Head there. Follow the line on your minimap, or use the golden target on your compass for guidance. I only played a short little bit, so that I could get comfortable with the controls. So it ain't bad at all. It's received high praise, the Falconeer, so I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna fly around and find out. I am Falcon Man. Part man, part dude who rides on Falcon. At the next waypoint, oh. we'll practice targeting and focusing. There is a barge up ahead. Find it and stay locked on. Find the bargey. Hopefully there's not too much RG bargey going on around here. Oh. There it the is. barge has a turret. Consider it a sub-target. Lock onto that for accuracy. Your weapon will indicate when it is aligned with a locked-on target. If the target lock indicators are blinking, cool. it should feel like the weapon is aiming itself. Not bad. Now open fire. Destroy the turret and the ship. Keep your eyes on the target for each path. It's like they got weird once I released the... Uh... The targeting screen. Aha! You want to bayonet in the neck, Greenhorn? If you get that close to a ship, they'll be having stew and bird for dinner. Get your distance. Make a run and veer before you hit a ship or static target. Don't be a fool now. 
Nice work. I didn't Your know they had like anti-bird technology. We'll need to recharge it from a nearby thunderstorm. I gotta recharge my energy. Be careful. There are neutral traders, friendly patrols, and airships around at this time. Do not fire on them. Your compass will display friendlies as white and blue, while any hostiles will show up in red. Sometimes when I turn around, I accidentally fly up. Do you have any advice for that? Sure. Looks like things are about to get a little too argy bargy, if you ask me. Why do I naturally just do little circles? Fly into the clouds to attract the lightning. At any sign of overheating, dive towards the ocean to cool down. Full ammo pots are glowing at the back of your bird. Perhaps you'll make it to the guards after all. Not too shabby. Let's head back to the palace. So they're supposed to be blue and green? Well, this one's red now. What does that mean? I need a little bit more time with that part. Stay alert! Warbirds near the Imperial flagship! Pirate side wager! Weapons free! Use deadly force! Oh lord! Death. They're shooting at me! Well, oh, they're dead Remember, now. track the targets! Aim ahead of their trajectory! Is that the soul of the birds bird releasing? Avoid incoming fire. World flagship of the Emerton! Captain Benedict! Get away from her, you bitch. There you go. What else we got? I need a warbird. Well done. Focus on where oh. the tracers are landing, not your gun sight. Shooting while turning will radically change That's right, you can dive into the water. Land. Remember, we weave and turn to get behind our targets. Get behind your target and only then fire. I got that part, sir. Me and the bird are one. Part bird man. Am I missing I something? Oh. What's this? A raid! They are aiming for Her Majesty's flagship! This is madness! Intercept them! Protect the entrance! Your warbird is equipped with a pyro pot. This will release a burst of self-guiding rockets. Most Falconeers will dodge them with a roll or die, but they will decimate slower targets. We are with you! We protect our own! Are we good? Captain Benedict, talk to me. How's the Empress doing? It's in gunfire. What? A Mansa task force! Get ready! This is a major bloody assault! The Imperial flagship! He was doing fine a second ago. The Empress! You traitors! How am I the traitor? I didn't do nothing. It was that big Death enemy ship over there. For us all. Now we can be reborn from the depths. <laughs> Memories retain as splinters of our fractured self. But we fear the other, that which remains tied to us. You must become the other, relive the lives of those lost. It's like my potential's being realized right in front of me. In order to discover the truth, we must start at the beginning with an ambitious heart. A first heartbeat will grow into a thousand consequences. You are the chosen one, and there will be consequences for it with your precious heartbeats. A good position amongst several currents makes Dunkel a favored stop for traders seeking to circumvent Imperial tariffs. A natural harbor, Dunkel has survived longer than many other settlements along the fringes of Imperial control, and boasts its own small mining concession along the moor. Along the moor? Limited side missions, no hostile territories, main enemy pirates, recommended level zero to eight. That's Choose my level. Choose now what stories and memories await you. What can be gleaned from these lives? Do I have to? I have to choose someone else. Free man, free man, free man. 
guess they all fight differently. There you go. Now I'll be a lady. Oh man, my, how come my skills are so much lower than before? Ascend now, Falcon. You can place a different one each time. On the Earthy, the Imperial Houses rule. Or do you have a heart the Mansa by you? Order researches, maintains, and controls Does this technology. Does game have affinity? And the common people, well, they do the work. Fish the Earthy, trade between its settlements, and ultimately always suffer from the fragile balance of power between the Imperium and the Mansa Order. Few people are more aware of this than the people of Dunkel, a speck on the Earthy, and barely a glimmer on the titanic struggles of the Great Houses. This part of the Earthy has been plagued by pirates and criminals who find a welcome home far enough away from the Imperial law to do as they please. Pirates. Freaking pirates. Any Greenhorn must get familiar with our holdings and our neighbors. You will start with the White Patrol, acclimatize yourself with the area, and deal with any threats. Yes. Thank you, Master of Letters Elkforn. Dunkel, Splinters, 300 Berries, what is this? Is this One Piece? Like, what is that satchel of, like, <laughs> of sapphires? You're new here. I've selected a number of tasks and locations that are important for you to be aware of. Oh, just click on them and learn about them? Is that what this is? We have someone dropping mines over trade routes going into Dunkel. This is a good opportunity for you to learn some handy tricks. Oh, you got the missions, do you? And you sell the items. I gained a level. Look at me. Looks like I got 16... Uh, 1699 berries. Wait. Requirements not met for the last one. Lightning rod, standard ammo. Be careful when you charge them yourself. They can overheat. Lightning pot used. What does that mean? Shark blood. Shark blood simulates the adrenaline glands into permanent fear response and proves the, the agility of your warbird. <laughs> you just <laughs> scare them to be better. Mutagens. Uh, Dunkel is open to trading community permits. Are pretty cheap, but you still need one to do basic business. Alright. Hold on. This try increases the range in which you collect splinters. Don't have enough of that. I'll get this. Why not? Purchase permit? Yes. Now it is legal for me. I have made it legal. Heavy weapons? Magnetar rifles are high impact variants of lightning casters. Sufficient. Sacrificing fire rate for increased damage. I might be interested in those. For centuries, it casts charged bolts at high speed and at rapid fire. Is that what I already have? Yeah, that is what I already have. So this is my inventory. We got a fire pot, three lightning pots, and a pyro pot. Longer traders have been offering these rare devices for many cycles. If fitted to an ammo slot, they launch pyrotetic ordnance, which, through unknown means, find their way to their target. Oh my. Through wizard magics. You're new here. Hold on. We oh, have training. someone Let's dropping mines over trade routes going into Dunkel. This is a good opportunity for you to learn some handy tricks. Let's do it. I'm a handy trick. We'll head for the mines. <laughs> this cow drives like shit, right? There they are. Dive into the water close to a mine and your bird will pick it up. Excellent. Drop it on something solid where it can do no harm. Just keep a good distance. They are explosive after all. You all right. can also try and it. bounce them. Build some speed and the mine will bounce in the direction you're heading in. We don't no. have any big cannons or mortars here at Dunkel. We like to borrow these mines to do some heavy damage when needed. Throw the remaining mines so they explode. Don't hit anyone. Then we can head back. How do I throw? I think it's like X or something, maybe? B? Y? Nope, that's my missiles. Alright, high speed. I got the speed. I got the needs for speed. Can I destroy the mines? With the mines, I'm assuming A is drop mines? No, it's not. Oh, it's right bumper. 
Did it explode? Or is it just bouncing? I think it's just bouncing. They have a slow bounce to them, but they get the job done. I like the camera control. Pretty much a full, full range. I think it re-zeroes just a little fast, but I can work with it. It ain't bad. Oh god. Can I re-catch it after I've already started bouncing it? Yes, I can. That's nice. Can we dive bomb with it? That's the real question. Let's practice. Ups, ups. Down, down, down. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That slicks back real well. I'm liking this. Give me that. Give me that little treat. Give me that. All right, pick up speed. Whoa. Are there any more? We should complete return. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm a good bird. <laughs> Polly wants all the crackers, you hear me? How do I land? Do I just fly into it? Oh, 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 I think I have to approach it a certain way. Hold on. This does slow down. There you go. Hold A to land. Well done. Uh -huh. We need to be inventive with the pirate threat. You're not going to see any Imperials lobbing mines. I got 300 splinters for that. Accuracy percentage. Well, destroy pirates, flying targets. It is embarrassing. Okay. Bonus unlocked. Score 83. That doesn't make any sense. All I did was have to blow them up. Did I need to do it faster? Was that it? 12% accuracy. What was that? My, what, what did I need to be accurate with? I'm very, I'm concerned, but also. You're new here. I've selected a number of tasks and locations. Can I just do it again? Can I just do these over and over again until I have a billion dollars? Wait. I'll do that off camera. I won't do that right now, right now, but I might do that off camera just so that we never have to worry about money ever. You've seen Uptrass and Fish. I've noticed you've been relying on your birds diving to build up speed and energy. How about you find some updrafts to boost you along instead? Or even hitch a ride on a jet stream? I also want to see you do some fishing and feed your bird. Oh, I'm gonna feed my bird. You better believe it. Let's do this. As soon as I was like playing this just to get the controls, I was like, the art styles are similar to Sea of Thieves. But there's something very cute about this game that I'm really enjoying. Even though it is technically like this uh, airplane fighter game, but it has like an open world aspect that's supposed to show up. It will. Ah. So that's why I was flying up randomly. There's updrafts. Oh, good lord. What is this? Find a jet stream high in the air to ride. But there's so much cool stuff down there. Now I have to be up here. Can I see what jet streams look like? Oh, there it is. Oh, look at that. I wish it stood out just a little bit more. It's kind of hard to see against the clouds. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Righteous, righteous. Is that what that's supposed to be? Catch fish to get an energy boost. Hold on, let's get to the, let's get to the area before we do the dive. I really like the dive. If we can target it from here. Oh, I missed it. It's right there. Oh, I got a fish. Right bumper to use or drop. This is a use function. Oh, I thought it was going to be animation for it. It just explodes. Oh, there's, there's a new discovery over here. Let's go look at it. Let's go activate it. Also, let's check out this brand crevasse. Civilian, 2 out of 13. Carathone. Look at this. Oh my god. The rift. Is the yacht, the ocean's just constantly pouring into here? How come that looks like ground down there, though? 
I know. Oh, it is water. There is water down there. But there's also like islands down here. This planet that the game is based on is like an oceanic planet, so it's mostly water. But I'm really liking the idea and the design. What if we explore the whole planet? What if it, like you go to the edge, it just takes you back around? What is this? Hold on, there's something glowing down here. Mission complete. Could return home. I don't want it though. Oh look, it's caught on me. Ow! <laughs> Are those air mines? No, oh, thank you then. Don't give it of those. Give it of some of those. I'm trying to figure out what this golden thing down here is. I'll fly ahead, I assume, is to return home, like, really fast. You have to fly into something in a certain way. Because if it's collectible, I kind of want to grab it right now. You know what I mean? It could also be really high up. Didn't think about that. Sorry, bird. Let's take a look around. There's a boat there, stuck on that rock. Does this place get less foggy at night? Hey, right, let's just return home. Because that'd be pretty cool. Oh, it just teleports me back. Where's my perch? My dunkle perch. Get their approach from this side, otherwise it explodes instantly. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> it's a little, it's a little accurate. It's a little accurate. You gotta approach it just right. There you go. Wait, we need falconers that can use the environment to their advantage. Not whimly bimly bird people who don't know what they're doing up there. You're new here. I've selected a number of <laughs> I've tasks been new and here locations times. that are important. The biochemists at Kythera have sent out a request for supplies. Make sure they get them. You'll find their services tempting, but I've yet to see a wallbird look better after their treatments. <laughs> look better? Make sure they look worse after the treatments? What's the point then? Oh, I gotta deliver this. I'm going the wrong direction. It'd be simple, right? Do I have to drop it a certain way? Well, if I fly ahead now... It just takes off some time. I'm flying all the way over here. Man, that water is... bumping. Some fierce water. Wow, chemist Kytria. There you go. Ah, fresh supplies and just in time. We've got something brewing that needs them. As a token of our appreciation, pay us a visit in the future and we can vastly improve the power and abilities of your warbird. The Imperium relies on our services to maintain the upper hand in combat. And so should you. <laughs> We'll upgrade it for free next time. Not right now, though. Kind of smelly. Was that an enemy? I see a red dot. Oops. So far, I'm just learning basics. Oh, let's get that fish. Alright, that was bad. That was bad. Alright, I can fix it. I can fix it. Dude, you can't, can you lock onto the fish? That would help me out. I didn't get it. I'm just gonna practice this just one more time. I gotta get good at this. I'm probably gonna have to get fish in the middle of combat. I didn't get it. Is it because I don't need to heal right now? Ah, oh, there's one. Eat. 
Worst case, you just slam your face into it over and over again. Go for the best. What is this? Why is it red? Why is it getting bigger? Oh my god. I'm curious. Heidi Ho. Pirate, one of eight. Well, it's, can't do anything with it. Let's go ahead and go home. It's indestructible as far as the world's concerned. Mission complete. Turn home. It was just a delivery mission, you noob. I was trying to conquer the world already. You, you and your falconeer ways. All right. We continue to keep the biochemists at me, but be wary of them. Not a good a strange night. lot in a strange place. You're a strange place. You're new here. I've selected a number of tasks and locations that go. are important for you to be aware of. The Sea Chantress Festival. Let's do it. It's worth the Sea Chantresses are preparing a festival. It would be unwise of us not to donate to them. They offer vital healing services and their chants improve our warbirds. So let's do it then. Our services. Oh, we gotta deliver a case. Of the good stuff, I assume. I guess if you really wanted to just relax, you could auto fly everywhere. Then what would be the point of being a falcon over the great seas? Let's fly low. Let's fly low to the whistle blows. Low and fast. Hit and run tactics. Two six. Who's there? Who's there? Who there? Boats. Captain Berman. A civilian trader. Rector Magnus Stephen. It's a turret. All right. Fine. That's cool. That's square. Where? Madoin. I found you, Madoin. <laughs> Some call it a mad doin. I think that's a bit rude. <laughs> Some people call me a mad, mad doin. See, he's quite the doin. Quite the mad doin. Can I get up there faster? This slipstream's way up here. By the time I get up here to use it, it's gonna be pointless. And now we dive. Hard dive. Get that speed. Hold on, I gotta... <sighs> yes. Uh oh, I'm off course a little bit. Let's correct that. Wish there was a little bit more weather. And a little bit more ships. Otherwise, we're probably gonna be fast traveling most of the time. Oh man, there was another slipstream way up there. Maybe I should fly high. And just use the slipstreams. Yeah, that, that'd be obvious when I'm grinding. But as of now, we're here. Witch rock! Where? It'd be floating. It's full of witches. It's recharging my batteries. Witch rock. Civilian. Really glad I don't lose the box for when I do that. I gotta fly up there. But it's all lightning. Alright, I got it. When you approach from Thank below, you. it's a lot easier. This offering is greatly appreciated. Tell your master to provide one of our tokens to you. We can provide chants that unlock the deeper talents of yourself and your warbird. However, our services require contemplation at the ancient shrines on the Ursi. Make sure you visit these, and honor the water before you visit us. How do we honor the water? Explain that to me. Mission complete for turret. Well, that was fairly easy, to be honest with you.
even they knew they made the world maybe a little big. <laughs> I was like, we're gonna, should we give them an auto, like, like in the taxi for GTA? Should we give them a, <laughs> give them a boost to where they're going? I assume since we're like level one, that's why the random encounters aren't higher just yet. You did well. Here's a sea chantry. Oh, I got a 100% accuracy this on that This lesser one. token grants access to their services at Sacred Steps and Redmond. <laughs> You're new here. I've selected. How new am I? I have a nest of young warbirds. Very rare. Show me your, you can fly. Finish the race course at Dunkel within 30 seconds, and I'll sell you one. All right, fine. Requirements not met. What are the requirements, dog, dude, bro? You're new here. Any greenhorn must get familiar with our holding. Oh, is this the mission I should have done first? You will start with a wide patrol. Acclimatize yourself with the area and deal with any threats. Oh, okay. Yeah, so these are the main quests. I just did all the side quests. Where... Actually, it looks like if I go up to him, it looks like you can do You're them over here. and over again. I've selected so those a are number your grindy quests. Any greenhorn must get familiar with Let's do this. Make no bones. Dunkel is on its last legs. Make no Our holdings and trading ships have been under pirate attack for years. Competing free houses have been nibbling away. Oh. What you see today is all that's left of Dunkel. Let's try and keep what we've got safe. Oh, they, how dare they touch our Dunkel? These Imperial forts have been undermanned and undergunned for decades. It'll be good to show our faces around here to remind the Imperium we're still a free house. Salad Mount. One of the largest salad tree mining operations on the Ursi. Salad tree? It would be good for them to see our patrols and show them the Dunkel to aren't there. finished yet. Easter End is on the border for the wildlands to the north and the east. Pirates and all sorts roam those skies. Be careful. The lease all from sorts? the Mensa Order makes Madoin our only profitable holding. It is the lifeblood of Dunkel. Oh, Madoin. Prize for any house I'm gonna call him Madoin from now on. Have you seen Madoin? I'll be your wingman today. I'll assist you and assess your performance. <laughs> I'm gonna help you, but also judge you. <laughs> Good to know. Can I order to fly you into a mountain? <laughs> Do you mind? Do you mind showing me your dunkel? Oh, you're supposed to be going this way. You can really feel the breeze between your knees up here. Yeah, go ahead, charge me up. Charge me up, charge daddy. Oh, I can see that bar filling up. Fortress is under attack! It's a pirate race! Come on, check that one. Come on. <laughs> hey, you're a little on fire there, buddy. All right, coming around. Get weed. Gotcha. I already ordered him to attack that one. He's not doing. He's a sucker. I love that. I love that if they die mid-sentence, they just get cut off. That's amazing. The, the ocean is... Hey, Fort Ellis. Fortified position, one of twelve. <laughs> hey. Thank you, Fort Ellis. Marshal Esper, or Asper, whatever your name was. You guys do a good job around here. You make damn good pie. Oh, let's recharge before we go over there. It's not charging. I guess I got confused about what the bar underneath is. I'm assuming that recharges the blue bar. Gave my wingman several orders. I don't see him. 
Oh, there he is, way back there. Huh, maybe we should get an icon for him. That'd be something to add. I'm sure there is. If I'm looking at him, I could probably target him. Like the other times. But... Like, if that could pop up, at least when I turn my camera and look. That'd be a nice little flavor. Nice little... What's it called? Cerebell! What a sight! It's made the Cerebell family wealthy and competitive. You can smell their greed from here. Alright, so... They, they mine it. So it's a plant that you have to mine. And you... You guys are so lazy, you couldn't name it anything except for salad. I'm gonna go mine some salad, dude. Don't you worry about it. Okay, right, we're here. We don't take kindly strangers here. Show me some proof of good conduct. Salad mount permit. How come we can't buy it? I'll just leave. Oh, this is this was new where the mission was. We just showed up here. It was just a rendezvous point, I guess. Look at it. That's where they mine the salad that I eat for my lunches. Good old salad mount. Nothing beats that. I like to sprinkle a little bit of granite on top of my salad. They're mined from the same mine. And that's flavor, it does. Ah, the sea. Home to whales. The big Incoming. wet, some people call it. Stop it, stop it, stop it! Alright, homie. <laughs> they didn't say anything that whole time. That whole time they were getting lit up. They were just like, well, I guess this is it. I'm a pirate. And I signed up for this with my bird. Now the bird's behind me shooting lightning bolts of magic at me. I guess this was fate, you know what I mean? Get him. Oh, 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 oh. Mm. Another set of Dunkleton is trying to scrape by on their scurvy birds and daddy's rusted guns. Get him, boys! There's one up there. Careful. Target him. Dunkle. <laughs> Get his Dunklins. We represent Dunkle. You're no match for my Dunkle, alright? Leave it at that. <laughs> the sea is unforgiving, unlike me, where I forgive very little. It's similar, but different. Grab that fish. Eat it. Consume. Apex Predator. Were we supposed to destroy that turret that was over here, too? I'm running low on the juice. Let's grab some juice. Yes. Ah, oh, strike me in the sky, Daddy. There you go. Moving along. Where am I supposed to go there? I'm supposed to go way over here. Is that the sun? 
Or is a hydrogen bomb encroaching on me? Seed's clear. Let's head back to Dunkel. Let's discover the Madoin again. <laughs> Alright. Going back to the Dunkel. Is that a dragon? Wait a minute. I knew we had birds in this world, but do we have dragons as well? What is going on there? The Burian Lustoff. Okay. Maybe it's just a different kind of bird. Mission complete. Let's go home, boys. Are we already really close to Dunkel? I guess we are. <laughs> my do my doin isn't that far from my Dunkel. Alright. Beautiful. Ah, oh, water spouts. Ooh, it's an uplift. Good work. You were instrumental in taking out that pirate. <laughs> nice. Good at our jobs. What's we the are next getting mission? reports Sarge? from navigation boys going missing. The boys are essential for traders visiting Dunkel. These aren't safe waters. You mean boys? We have to investigate. You call them the boys. <laughs> like, like you're, they're your boys. Like you love them. Like, these are my boys. <laughs> your boys, bro? Nah, they're my boys. I love them. Who would steal a buoy? Hold on. Yes. I'm sending you to search the area and find the navigation boys that have been reported missing. <laughs> this should be a piece of cake. Maybe a Mosul dragged them away. Or someone's been plundering them for materials. Let us hope it's that straightforward. If you find the culprit, make sure you teach them a lesson. No one messes with our property. No one, messes with, the, no no one messes with my boys. And the whereabouts of our boys. No one messes with my Dunkel, no one messes with my boys. Simple. That's how we rule things around here. No one messes with my boys, no one messes with my Dunkles, and no one messes with my boys' Dunkles. Let's keep that clear. Ooh, ooh don't mind if I does. Oh. And I'm getting refilled. I can't see a boy for miles. <laughs> I can't see a boy for miles. Plenty of girls, though. Am I right? <laughs> Am I right? Let's get in there. Hello, ladies. Batis. Oh my god, what's that big sea thing they caught? Look at that. Oh my god, is that a Plateosaur? What is that? I think it is. Crikey. Now, this game had huge rolls and flying wells to be perfect. Kind of wish the sky was a little bit clearer so you could see more of the ocean, get like a bigger draw distance, you know what I mean? The Castellus boy is also gone. I'd go down there and ask him where it went. But touching the ground on a mission is not looked upon kindly in our trade. <laughs> Use your radio to go talk to them then. Right, hello, Castellus. Have you seen any boys around here? Boys? Boys. Boys? Yes, boys. Have I seen any boys around here? Yes, I'm looking for my boys. Is this Dunkel again? All right. Are you talking about buoys? Yes, my boys. A whale! Oh, he had spikes on his head too. He's like. Ah, he's another like, one gone. What? This is quite the mystery. Airborne Emporio. Can we catch the whale? 
That is dope. That is dope. Is this your boy? <laughs> I want this to be my boy. Imperium floating over there has bells. That's kind of cool looking. I got a mine. Can I target the mines down there and tell them to pick up one too? They shoot a mine that I'm holding. That's gonna hurt, right? It's that dickweed pirate scum again. They must have taken the boy. Here. Have a bomb, sucker. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> In one shot. Oh, I missed. Uh oh, it's coming back. Did you not just see how bad it took out your boat? And your point man by that? Ah, well if it isn't the junk a lot! Did you mind us taking your toys? You sank our barracuda! Time for payback! You hear that? They're gonna try to get payback against us. Are you ready? Let's show them our dunkles. <laughs> All right, you target that one. I'll target this one. Yeah, give us back our boys. Oh, right, can we get not get gotten in a claw fight? We can't lock talons. Talon versus talon. No! Yes. Indeed, a calls. <laughs> That's from the boys. Oh, he actually does injure him, but it looks like it takes him a while to actually take it out. Not as bad as Ace Combat 6 when, like, they literally just fly around doing nothing. And it literally not takes a, um, several hours for them to kill something. Why. Could be there using it for salvage. Would be odd, though. Let's head back. You can head back. I'm gonna eat this fish. That was for my dunkle. On a random updraft, not on purpose. Where? Dunkle? Show me your dunkle, Lytus. Duncan? There you go. Oh, that didn't count. Too fast. Too furious. Slow it. Down. There it is. We know it was the pirates who stole our boys. And they've enjoyed themselves too. Taking what's ours. Doing disgusting Damn things shame. to our boys. Cam Underhill. Yeah, I come in and get the destroying the fixed target. The boat knock out is a fixed target? What's it count as? 61% score? What are you talking about, man? Did you not see that bomb we have drop? Sightings of pirates around Madoin. A raid on Madoin would be disastrous. It could jeopardize our leasehold on the mine. <laughs> Dunker will never let them touch Madoin. Let's do it. The what messages coming are garbled. One describing a swarm of pirates. I have no idea what that means, but be prepared. <laughs> it's definitely Madoin more than one. On the moor. All right. It has a few defenses, but nothing that can stand up to a proper raid. <laughs> Head for yeah, we've been there. It's like we'll one dude in a turret. So let's hope for the best. Godspeed. Doi. My Dunkle won't let, let my Madoi be <laughs> Bad vulnerable. About this. Let's keep a close eye on each other. Righteous. You watch me, I'll watch you. Stand and deliver. Ah, the pea soup is thick today. In the, am I right, free man? Oops, uh, I get excited sometimes. 
Oh, you can actually zoom out the map. Or zoom it in if you need to. That's nice. Let me check my inventory. Do I... Uh-oh, something's happening. Damn you! Pirates! Fire the Kraken! It's their voice! They set them adrift into Mad or Ye. It's a massive armed blockade. We need to take out every boy. They've armed the boys. There goes one. Foolishly enough, they've been dropping mines behind them. Probably just stop the other boats once they drop that one. Coming in. Coming in spicy. Cover me. Line it up. Release. <laughs> they they turned our boys into into floating turrets. Target that freak job. I'm gonna come back around and grab another mine. Line it up. Release! He's almost down. Oh, help. What's that? An airship? These pirates are full of surprises. Let's bring it down. <laughs> you got it, man. I'll help you bring it down. Okay, you go ahead and target it. Mine. I'm going to grab another mine. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Well, you got it already, because you're very good at your job, apparently. Never mind. You should never underestimate you, Freeman. You're the spirit of Dunkel itself. Now to carelessly drop this mine. <laughs> made it, but at what cost? There's no victory here. <laughs> this will be disastrous for Dunkel. I thought that was my line. Oh, man. You okay? Madoin! They got hit hard. We'll have to repair. No, they hurt my doin, which in turn hurt my dunkel. How could they do this? Bloody pirates. One day, I'll show them the full power of my Dunkel. How'd I miss this? Oh, well, there it is. I was like... I was just next to it. You did well. We might have lost a full season's haul if it wasn't for you. But this is a sad day. There will be ramifications for Dunkel. You're right. It is time for the yearly tithe. You will be taking the payment for Meadowin's leasehold directly to the Mensa Order. And hopefully no one shows up to interrupt that. We need that. to pay the Mensa Order their share of the mine's profits. Had you not prevented the pirate attack, we would not have been able to scrape together a tenth of their levy. I'll cover you. We cannot let the M4 get hit. If it shatters under weapon fire or is dropped on the moor, and all will be lost. Be under no illusion. This will not be a safe journey. If anything happens, avoid combat and head to the Mensa Vault. Okay. So I gotta deliver this. So this is more about me protecting this than killing. If that's the case, I'll just tell him to kill everything while I fly away. Very interesting game. Reminds me of me. Both interesting.
Do I want to go? Find a slimy kraken, a bloody pirate ambush, head for the base of the moor, and get cover from the monster gun emplacements. Holy crap. Am I supposed to defend? That's a pagan right there. Is that even an enemy? I can't even tell. I think it's an ally, actually. We may have just bombed our ally really hard right there. There's a lot flying around around here. Good lord. I will hang your skull around my neck! You shall not stand in my way! Got a lot of good allies here. Damn good time. We're safe. Land and deliver the time. Hold on, can I grab whatever that is? No? Alright. Wait, really? Now I can discover it? Can't you try to land on it? There you go. Here's the we time. We appreciate the delivery of our lawful earnings. However, <laughs> combat over the moor in such close proximity with our vault has our rest to be into the water in front of their base? That's it's why I just some it. pirates trying their luck. Nothing more. We've taken care of the matter, as you can see. This is not how we perceive the circumstances. Increased tension between our order and House Borgia leaves us with no choice. Dunkel's leasehold of Madoyin will not be renewed. What? This is an outrage! We provided the order with untold profits from Madoyin's mines. We Madoyin's? don't even have business with House Borgia. This is not our fault. You may be mere pawns in a much greater game, but that does not make you immune to the consequences. The matter is closed. Next season, we will lease Madoin to another. Goodbye. They took Madoin away. Is this because I dropped it into the ocean? That's where you told me to put it. They paid their tithes. Thanks, thanks, These are dire times. That just hurts my donkle, man. Mission complete. Go home. I got, went there. We blew up a bunch of stuff. I delivered the payment, and now they're like, ah, go home. Loser. We're gonna take your doin away. We're gonna sell it to someone else. The pirates like to shoot at you. We want someone who's better at protecting it, apparently, than just you crazy little donkles. Your insane amount of dunkle fever you guys like to talk about. I did it again. I flew past it. Sarks piss. Without the profit Sarks piss. We are doomed. Get out and leave me be while I gather my senses. Definitely was not my fault. I did a pretty awesome job. A unique opportunity has presented itself. A lone pirate skull ship has been spotted near the moor. You Falconers, oh. take it down and retrieve whatever intel you can from the wreckage. Let's do it. Revenge. The captain's reported a suspected pirate skull ship over the moor. It's payback time. We have reached a critical point. If you think Dunkel can sink any lower, you are mistaken. We must find information on these ships. Anything to turn the tide. For this mission to succeed, we need to watch each other's backs. We've been on the end of far too many drubbins. Let's return drubbins. the favor to these earthy scum. The skull ship was spotted here, over the moor. We need to find it and take it out. Once the skull ship has crashed, search the wreckage. Hopefully we'll get some intel. I like this Freeman Good guy. Good luck, you two. Pick to the skies. Hope Quickly I get to now. keep him as my. Hope I get to pick like my um uh, 
my wingman for a mission, because if I can keep him forever, because he reminds me of Fable. The way he talks. I can almost hear him, chicken chaser, will you chase chickens? These skull ships are the pirate's latest weapon. This is about retribution, but also retrieving any new information we can. The Shrine of the Sark. Remember that Sark piss I mentioned there earlier? Mind your ammo. If you run out, the turrets sometimes drop their ammo for you to use. Righteous. There was continuity the entire time. Oh, his bird's blue. He thinks he's better than us. Ow. Help! Help! <laughs> the one thing he said. Help! Help me! The dunkle is shoosting at me. Ow! I'm supposed to roll those, that's right. Did a good job. I just told it was too busy targeting me, didn't ignore you. That's the thing we need. You found it. Eat the fish. You get that health. Amazing. Let's get that back to Dunkle. He might have some useful intel. It better. The big treasure chest. It's almost as big as their barge, man. Maybe not that big, but still like maybe a third or a fourth of it. Look what we retrieved for our dunkle. Alright, this time I did recognize it, but I doubted myself. This is a it seems to contain the truth. Oh, I got the Dunkle permit. I didn't need to buy it. To learn something about the pirate menace from this. Ooh, it's only all 69. Oh, nice. The trove of documents has yielded a wealth of information. It's time to act upon its revelations. And we will do that. But it looks like we ran into my limiter that I like to set for myself. So we're gonna go ahead and do a little cut right here. Thank you all, Ewok Templar. We're going through the Falconeer. It's got good reviews. It's a cute flying shooting indie game. And honestly, I, I actually really like it already. So we're gonna go through it. We're gonna see how far and deep into the far end of this game we can go. Thank you all, hopefully you all enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe, hit that like button. Keep on posting. I'll see you all in the next episode. Y'all take it easy. Talk to them then. Right, hello, Castellus. Have you seen any boys around here? Boys? Boys. Boys? Yes, boys. Have I seen any boys around here? Yes, I'm looking for my boys. Is this Dunkle again? All right. Are you talking about buoys? Yes, my boys. A whale!